Wouldn't it be awesome to help discover something totally new in space? Throughout history, telescopes have helped us explore the universe from right here on Earth. But not everyone has access to telescopes or the data they produce. Wouldn't it be better if we could all participate? Rubin Observatory thinks so. And that's why it makes more data available to more people than ever before. Not just scientists, but you too. How does Rubin Observatory turn light from space into data we can all explore? Come with us and find out. First, we go to Chile, where Rubin Observatory takes huge pictures of space from high on a mountain. But these pictures are so big that you need 378 4K television screens to view just one. That's not a practical way to do astronomy. So instead, the camera converts light from space into data and pushes the data out into the night. The data slide down the mountain on high-speed fiber optic cables. Then they zip along other cables that take them to the United States by land and under the sea. The data are processed and cleaned up at supercomputing centers in the U.S. and in other places around the world. Once they're the most useful they can be for astronomy, Rubin Observatory releases them to scientists. In the past, researchers needed expensive computers and software to analyze astronomy data. But they can work with Rubin data using just an internet browser. That means more scientists can participate in astronomy than ever before. But Rubin Observatory wants to make space exciting for everyone, whether you're a trained scientist or just someone who thinks science is cool. So, we built a website where you can explore stunning images and exciting new stories about the universe, and even contribute to real, cutting-edge astronomy research. What will you discover?